What's up, mermaids? Welcome back to our channel. And for today's video, um, I really have something to talk about. This video is actually for all of us because it's really very scary right now and our mental health is suffering. As someone with um, anxiety disorder and with a mental disability, Sobrang hirap na hirap ako, guys. And I've been in constant communication with my friends who has the same issues as me. Married din silang anxiety and sobrang heightened yung anxiety namin. And right now, filming, pawis na pawis yung kamay ko because every day, I get panic attacks. And, uh, my health anxiety is really on its high season right now. And I can't blame myself. I can't blame my sisters out there, my brothers out there who's having a hard time dealing with this because sobrang nakakatako talaga siya. For one, ako, yung health anxiety ko talagang sobrang umaatake siya. I keep on thinking I have COVID. Um, kung pati lang yung lalamunan ko, sobrang spiraling down na talaga ako na umiiyak ako buong araw thinking I have the virus and hahawaan ko yung mga tao dito, ganun. So, hopefully, wala naman akong symptoms. I don't, I'm not coughing, I don't have fever, and I'm not, you know, having difficulty breathing and thank God for that because Sobra talaga. Pero minsan, sa sobrang... Kasi may hypochondria ako eh, Which means, my body is producing the symptoms of this sickness that I'm afraid to get. Yun yung gusto kong pag-usapan natin ngayon. Because, parang, nakakatakot siya. You know? Para sa mga bagong nakaka-experience ng gantong pakiramdam. Yung kinakabog ka, na mamawis ka. It's so scary. Kami sanay na kami. Pero still, when it attacks, sobra pa rin yung fear. But, you know, I'm here to say... What you're feeling is valid, it's normal, and it's okay to be scared, it's okay to cry. Um, siguro, I'm making this video so I can help you cope with it. Kasi, actually ako, I'm still having a hard time coping. As of the moment, talagang, I still have this fear inside of me na the, the virus might come inside the house, might infect kaming lahat, mamatay kaming lahat dito sa bahay, or ako, ganyan. So, it might infect my family, my parents who are senior citizens, you know, na sila talaga yung at risk eh, um, when it comes to this virus. So, ang daming fears in my head and ang panglaban ko talaga sa kanila lately is prayers. Yun yung isa sa mga bagay na hindi nawawala sa buong araw ko, yung pagdadasal, my trust in the Lord. Minsan naghumingi ako ng tawad sa kanya kasi parang nakakalimutan ko na pagkatiwalaan siya kapag sobrang takot at takot ako. Um, I'm really thankful and grateful. I have a very good support system, especially Sidin. She's very good in handling me when I have attacks like this. And, you know, um, it's really good to have her in my life. I have friends na nakakausap ko about this. I can open up to them without them judging me. Thank you so much to my friends. Steffi, Santana, Bing Castro. Ayan, ay ko nakakausap. Si Kylie, si Mare, hi, si Sis PV. Ayan yung mga madalas kong kausap tungkol dito. Si Sis Sarah. Maraming maraming, maraming salamat sa inyo sa pakikinig nyo sa akin. At um, nakakatulong eh kapag nalalabas mo yung pakiramdam mo. So, if you're experiencing this right now, it's good to have someone to talk to, to express your feelings and to tell them without being scared of being judged yung lahat ng nararamdaman mo. Importante yun kasi talagang whenever someone can understand what you're going through, parang nakakagaan siya ng pakiramdam. Lately, I've also been going to forums, um, yung mga anxiety help groups na pinupuntahan ko before nung kasagsagay na anxiety ko and um, nagulat ako kasi pagtingin ko dun sa forums, ang daming topics about coronavirus, about health anxiety. So, binasa ko siya, I reply to the threads, and you know, we exchange our support to each other. So, you can also do that kasi marami kang mapupuntahan. So, I will just put um, a link down below nung group na pinupuntahan ko for the help group with the anxiety. So, yan, isa yan sa mga pwede natin gawin. And also, here in the Philippines, we have hotlines to call for support. If you're having a mental breakdown, kung kailan mo nang kausap, so wala ka makausap. So, I will put the numbers here on the screen and on the description box below para ma-access nyo yung mga numbers na that you can call. We really need all the help that we can get. You know. So, ito. Sa YouTube, ang daming mga um, <clears throat> meditations. 
na pwede nating ma-access yung mga binaural beats for um, calming down your stress and your anxiety. Um, meron din yan to boost your immune system. So, manami ka ma-access. Si, um, si Michael Healy, favorite ko talaga siya. So, you can try, um, you know, checking out his page. Sa cellphone ko din, mermaids, manami akong mga apps that helps me a lot with my mental health. So, is this a app ko dito is yung WhatsApp. So, ayan. As in, WhatsApp, pangalan niya. So, it has a lot of coping strategies and mechanism for you. And there's also a personal help diary here. I don't know if you can see it kasi maliwanag yung phone ko. Pero, ayan siya. So, marami siyang activities actually. You can check it out. Download WhatsApp. And then, there's also, like, you know, coping with anxiety. Yung positive thoughts, physical sensations. Basta, you can access a lot of activities and information in this app. So, um, nakakatulong sa akin doon kapag nagkakaroon ako ng anxiety attack to divert, to distract my mind from thinking of that certain feeling. So, yung mga activities na ginagawa ko, like, meron dito sa WhatsApp yung think of five pink elephants riding in a dolphin. So, di ba madidistract yung isip mo? Para mga ganun yung activities niya sa WhatsApp. Tapos, one more app that I love is Think Up. So, this is actually a positive mindset app. So, Think Up. Wait lang ay ayaw niya mag-load. Medyo mabagal yung internet. So, ayan. Um, you can record your own voice to um, recite affirmations. So, ako, I have five affirmations here that I recorded na pwede mong paulit-ulitin. Kasi, di ba, positive thinking, sometimes it really works. Like, when you manifest it out there, it will really go to you. Di ba? So, Ito yung mga affirmations ko. I'm grateful for the good in my life. Lord, cast out fear. Remove all doubt. Every cell in my body is overflowing with health, healing, and love. I am perfectly healthy in body, mind, and spirit. And my fears are melting away. So, if I will play it for you right now, you will hear... grateful for the good in my life. You can hear my voice. Lord, cast out fear. Remove all doubt. Block unbelief cause a wavering trust to be stirred within me. Every cell in my body is overflowing with health, healing, and love. So, ayun siya. ulit ko lang siya, ko siya music, and it really helps when you hear your own voice telling, I mean, um, pushing yourself up. So, that's one app that I really love. Siyempre, yung isang app na hindi mawawala, yung mga devotionals about praising God, about the Lord. So, isa sa app na super favorite ko is yung Abide. Na-introduce sa akin siya ni Ella. So, si Ella's Daily. Um, I purchase this app actually every year for longer meditation. Pero may free version siya ng mga 2 minutes meditation. So, it's about scripture. So, you, del you um, meditate on scripture every day. Meron siyang scriptures for sleep, anxiety, emotions, and a lot, a lot more things. So, you can choose any topic that you would love. There are sleep stories when you can sleep. So, ayan o, maraming sleep stories that last for like 30 minutes or so ng makatulog ka na. So, ayan. Um, it really helps me a lot when I can't sleep because of thinking too much. Tapos, meron din siyang mga topics like, you know, ayun, deeply love, forgiven and cleansed, diba, counsel by spirit, moving on. So, there's a lot that you can choose from. And I really love this app. I purchased this every year for like 1,500 pesos to access a lot more of the app and also to help out the, um, the, uh, what do you call this? The makers of the app. Because it's really, it, this really helps me a lot. Um, especially when I was just starting with my anxiety before. Sobrang laki ng tulong sa akin ito. And of course, I have my devotionals yung kay Joyce Mayer. I have the Bible app, the devotion app on my phone. And um, I have also the, what to call this? Um, let me look for the app lang ha. Ang dami ko sa apps sa phone ko about. And daily bread really helps me a lot as well. Kung mahilig naman kayo sa essential oils like me, kung naniniwala kayo na nakakatulong siya to calm you down, to relieve stress, you can download this app, Essential Oils. Ayan. Um, andito lahat ng listahan ng essential oils and yung gamit niya. And, um, ayun nga. May mga lavender lemon. So, para saan siya? Kung saan mo siya pwedeng i-apply? Ano yung pwede mong ihalo sa kanya? Ganon. Ang daming gamit ng mga oils talaga para sa atin guys merong pang relieve ng stress pang relieve ng headache kahit dysmenorrhea pa yan, pang boost ng immune system which is super kailangan natin so ako ang mix ko lately is lavender, lemon, peppermint and frankincense for um, well-being para sa um, 
bag boost ng immune system to calm me down. I also do water manifestation. Uh, habang nagpapaaraw ako, binubulungan ko yung tubig ko ng mga positive words sa mga gusto kong mangyari. Like, this water will heal me. This water will protect me from any virus and bacteria. Ganon. Tapos, ini-imagine ko yung color niya na nag-activate like orange and yellow for boosting the immune system. Tapos, sabang iniinom ko siya, ini-imagine ko yung color na parang smoky color na binabalot yung lungs ko and my throat and cleansing it out, ganon. So, ganon yung ginagawa ko pag nag-water manifest ako. And it really helps a lot kasi, di ba, parang ini-instill mo siya sa mind mo. So, ayan guys, I just wanna check on you. Mga mermaids ko dyan, mga nakakapanood nito. Um, it's scary. And it's okay to be scared. It's okay to fear. Pero lagi nating tatandaan na may Diyos, hindi niya tayo papabayaan. Alam ko na sa panahon ngayon, it's it's easy to say for me. It's easy, actually, lagi na mag It's easy to say, do this, do that. Pero sometimes when you're there, it's hard to move. It's okay. Take it one step at a time. Take it slowly. At, you know, mag mag madarating ka rin dun eh. So, totoo lang, mermaids, um, bala ko talagang maging productive during the home quarantine. Pero ngayon lang ulit ako nakapag-film. Ngayon lang ulit ako nakakilos. Kasi I've been in bed the last five days crying my heart out, thinking I have COVID. And so many anxieties going through my head. Pero ito, fifth day, I tried to push myself up. And I try to, to use my platform to good use. So, Again, comment kayo down below, mermaids. I want to talk to you. Please, uh, comment kayo kung ano yung mga takot nyo, yung mga iniisip ninyo. Makakatulong eh pag nalabas. Tapos, interact tayo with each other. This COVID pandemic is really messing up with your mental health as well. And kapit lang mga sis. Alam ko, sobrang hirap. Lalo na sa mga mayroon ng existing mental disability. Sobrang hirap. Pero kapit lang tayo. Message nyo ako sa Instagram, sa Facebook. Actually, nagbura pala ako ng Facebook, guys. Isa pa yung sa ginawa ko. I deleted my Facebook and Twitter to limit myself from fake news and from mga negative posts. So, Instagram lang yung um, remain ko sa social media ko ngayon. And this, of course, my YouTube channel. So, message nyo ako sa Instagram. Um, if you need support, if you need someone to talk to, and yun nga, yung mga numbers down below, you can call that um, for support. So, and mermaids, thank you so much for listening. And I'm praying for all of you. Pray Praying for all of us for the whole world. Don't forget to pray every day incessantly and take care of your mental health. It's very important um, together with our physical health. Kailangan pang alagaan din natin siya. Very random tong video na to. Hindi na ako nag-BS. Suot ko yung ano ni Zing, yung jersey niya na gusto gusto kong pambahay. Tapos eh, hindi na ako nagsukulay. Sobrang, but it's okay to be raw and I just want to talk to you really. Because talking to my mermaids, you know, it helps me a lot. Thank you, mermaids, for listening. I love you all. God bless. Bye. Take care.